New details now on the escape from a maximum security prison in New York. Authorities are following more than a thousand leads and have to start their search from zero yet again. We're also learning more about the prison worker who allegedly helped the prisoners escape and what her husband may have known. Convicted murderers Richard Matt and David Sweat have been on the run for 11 days now. Police say prison employee Joyce Mitchell gave the inmates the tools to escape. Mitchell's husband, Lyle, also worked inside the prison. According to CNN, Mitchell told her husband about the planned prison break and how she believed the murderers would try to kill him upon their escape. But still, Lyle visited his wife in jail Tuesday. All I know is that he said that he's standing by her, so that's what he told me when I spoke to him. Lyle's lawyer says he has no plans to testify on behalf of his wife. A wife who reportedly had a two year long sexual relationship with 49 year old escapee Richard Matt. Meanwhile, authorities have received more than a thousand leads and they plan to follow up with each one as they expand their search around upstate New York. I can assure everybody here and everyone who's listening or reading these reports that every lead is being followed up on to its conclusion, no matter where that lead is. Today, we have established approximately 1,300 leads that have either been investigated or are under investigation at this time. These are criminals, okay? They, they, they're going to rely on what they know best. So there's been no reports of any, any carjackings, any break-ins. That's not to say that they might not be holding someone at bay in a house somewhere. New York State Police just released these progression photos of David Sweat and Richard Matt. It shows what the pair might look like after 10 days on the run. If you spot these men anywhere, police say do not approach them and call 911 immediately. And police in New York State are expanding their search to new areas near the prison in Danamora, New York. The shift comes from information uncovered during the manhunt.